What's up everybody and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for clicking on our video today. We are always so happy to have you guys here. So if you're watching today's video, kindly consider subscribing to the channel because it's totally free. Do not forget to like and share this video with your friends and family. And also you can leave me a comment. Let me know which gown on this video is your favorite and why. So today's video is a continuation of our previous video and we were talking about the red flags to always look out for when you're touring a venue and on our previous video we had talked about poor communication and on our today's video we are gonna start off with bad reviews a couple's wedding should be the most special days of a day in their lives surrounded by their family their friends and yes vendors who work hard to make that day pure magic so it's a complete bummer when new any new words are less than happy about their venue choice though one negative review might be anomaly a handful of you know the disappointed customers could paint the picture of a very big red flag Sales venue reps will make it sound like a dream that the, that's their job. You need to do your research here from the honest couple that said reviews can only be taken with a grain of salt. So it's very important to suss out the experience yourself. If a venue's team is rude, they are unpleasant, they are disagreeable, make sure to take note of that. You can't always trust online reviews, especially if your direct experience is contrary to how they act or they treat you during tours and booking is when they should be the nicest. So the experience will only get worse if it starts off on a bad note.
Something else that could be a red flag is the limited setup time from laying down the dance floor to hanging up signage to getting that floral act just right. Setting up a venue takes time. So when you're selecting a venue, be sure to ask your, co your coordinator how much prep time your vendors will have. After all, nobody wants to scramble to create a dreamy backdrop. Outside my window is everything pale and cold Can't seem to pick up my phone It's been ringing all day long Behind these clouds I know the sun will be But today's raining So be patient with me I'll be if it's a two hour window run, you want a venue that is going to give your vendors enough time to set up. There is nothing worse of your vendor team execution and design wise if they are rushed. It reflects poorly on the entire team and that's when mistakes do happen. And it's also important to consider when the party, when the wedding party can access the property. One red flag that you need to look out for is what time the bride suit is available. Hair and makeup for the whole bridal party usually takes hours and begins very early in the morning so the last thing brides will want is to do uh, to do is gather everyone halfway through their hair and makeup process and move to a new location so guys thank you so much for watching our today's video i really hope that you really enjoyed it do not forget to like share and subscribe and i will see you on the next one Drinking ready to run Thought I'd be better by now But I can make my feet move along And as soon as I see you I forget about you Just as soon I get you Couldn't change my mind